I'm Leon Scott Baxter, the dumbest genius you'll ever meet, and the author of um, Secrets of, uh, of Safety Net Parenting. I talk to moms and dads about parenting, and uh, so if you have any questions or any comments for me or any topics, then uh, leave them in the comments below. And while you're at it, you might as well subscribe to my channel and like this video. I can't sleep. Something, something's been bugging me, okay? I got a cousin named, named Alex. Her real name is um, Alexis. We, we call her Alex. Uh, she's, a, she's a single mom. So she's got Todd, the nine-year-old, and then she's got, she got Junior, the, uh, the first grader. It's kind of funny because um, uh, Junior's name is Alex also, but he's not named after my cousin Alex. He's named after my cousin Alex's ex-husband, whose name was Alex also, but his name was not short for Alexis like her name is. His name was short for Alexander. Um, but this isn't about um, Junior. It's about Todd. Todd, the other one, the nine-year-old. Now Todd, Todd is in, in fourth grade, and Todd, he doesn't do any schoolwork. Doesn't do any schoolwork. So, so, so Todd, Todd gets an, um, a note home every week that says, it's to Alex, my cousin, saying he doesn't do any schoolwork, doesn't do any homework. None. Nada. Zip. Zilch. Goose egg. None. And I talked to my cousin about this and she says, now she, she's, she's, she threatens to take stuff away from him and, and says that she won't take him any place until he starts showing some effort and that she's on top of this and she's got it under control. But nothing changes. Nothing. Next week? Nope. Teacher. Mom, not doing work. Now let me tell you, Todd, he's my nephew. So he's not really my, he's not really my, my nephew, but he is like my nephew. They call me Uncle Leon, so. I think of him as my nephew. Both of them, Todd and Junior. Both of them. And Todd is a cool kid. He's a cool kid, he, especially outdoors. He's a cool kid. He loves bugs, and he loves animals, and he loves the outdoors. But when it comes to schoolwork, you know, So I asked his mom, I said, you know, Todd's a cool kid, what, what's he doing at home? What's he doing at home? She says, well, every day I send him to his room and he promises me he does his homework. Okay, and Alex, is he doing his homework? No, obviously not. If he promises you every day he's doing his homework and every week you get a letter saying he's not doing his homework and you know he's not doing his homework, why would you send him back in there to do his homework when he goes, I promise you, I'll do my homework? Because you know he's not. Come to find out, guess what's in his room? A TV. A big TV. He gets to watch his TV. He watches his TV. Oh no, Mom, I'm doing my homework. He's watching SpongeBob. I tell Alex, Alex, take the TV out of the boy's room. And she says, no, no, I can't do that. I, he, shares, he shares the room with his brother, Junior. And that, why would I want to punish Junior and take the TV out of the room? Because Junior's done doing nothing wrong. No, 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 no. No. I'll tell you why no. I'll tell you why there's so many no's. This is the why there's so many no's. Take the TV out of the room. You kill two birds with one stone. A six-year-old boy doesn't need to have a TV in his room either. Okay, but, but here's, what's, here's what's keeping me up at night. This is why I can't fall asleep. So the, the new Avengers movie came out a few weeks back. And, and Todd loves, loves the Avengers, right? So um, I, it comes out, opening night was like a Wednesday night, and I, I call him a couple days later and I say, Hey, what's up, nephew? What's up, Todd? How you doing? How's life treating you? He says, Guess what I saw, Uncle, Uncle Leon? Guess what I saw? And I said, What? What did you see? He says, he says uh, Avengers, Age of Ultron. I saw it on opening night. Mom took me. So I'm thinking, okay, he, he, must, he, must have, he must have got all his work done. This is his reward. So I asked his, his mom, Alex, hey, did, did you take the, the kid to see Avengers because he did all his work? And she tells me, nope, um, he didn't earn it. He just really wanted to go, and, and, and Junior earned it, so I took Todd along. Wait, what? First, first off, it's a school night. It's a Wednesday. There, there's no grade schooler in the world that needs to go to opening night in the movies on a school night. There's no need for that unless he is starring in the movie and needs to make an appearance on the red carpet. Next, if Junior had earned this, he could have gone on the weekend. You leave Todd at home with some friends or family and taken the kid who earned it 
to the movies on Saturday, not on a school night. Finally, Todd should be in the doghouse. A movie is, is a special treat. Uh, he needs to know there's consequences for his actions or, or lack of actions. If a, kid's messing, if a kid's messing up in school, they shouldn't be going to the movies uh, any night. Uh, Wednesday night, Saturday night, any night. No movies, messing up in school, not doing shit. Shouldn't be going at all. No. Look, kids, kids need consequences. Kids absolutely need consequences. If you, cousin Alex, if you don't, if you don't consequence your son, then, then all that work that teacher's doing is for nothing. All the notes she's sending you, all the, all the, the, the meetings she's having with you and the kids, and it, it's, it's, it's a waste of time. Also, if you can't get your son to get to work today when he's nine, think about how hard life is going to be in five years when he's 14. How hard life is going to be for you. He's not going to listen to you now. How is he going to listen to you when, he, when he's 14? You're digging your own grave, Alec. You're digging your own grave. Look, if, if you don't put your foot down now, there's going to be a point where it's too late for my nephew slash cousin. He will have never learn responsibility, and that's really not fair to him. That's not fair to him. It's, it, you might be looking like a knucklehead, but, it, but the truth is, he, he's got to learn this stuff somewhere. And sometimes you've got to put your foot down. Yeah, I know. I know it's hard being a parent, but that's what we signed up for. I know you did not sign up to be a single parent. You did not sign up to do this alone. But that's the reality of the situation. So look, take the TV out your boy's room, stop buying him ice cream and toys, sit down with him and make him get his work done so he learns responsibility. If he can get his work done for like maybe a week, maybe you give him a small reward. And if he can continue to do that more and more, maybe you change your reward, make him bigger or different. And if he starts becoming more independent where you don't need to sit by him to get his work done, maybe, just maybe, you take him to the movies. But never. On a school night? Come on, Alex. Alright, I am done ranting. If you have something to say about Alex or Todd or what I have said, leave it in the comments below. And you might as well like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that already. Also, check out my website, safetynetters.com. And if you want more like this at your disposal, consider grabbing my book, Secrets of Safety Net Parenting on Amazon.com. All right, uh, that took it out of me. I think I'm fine. Ready to hit the hay. And go to sleep. <clears throat> Good night.